Hey guys, welcome to another episode of... That's great. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Loot Crate Unboxing. Do you want to hear unboxing the Loot Crate? So, this is a little bit late, but I've been away and all the rest and such and such. This is dystopia, okay? So let's kick off right off the bat with the t-shirt, shall we? Now the t-shirt, obviously I'll be close-ups all the way through, you know how this runs by now. It's Robocop. And I must admit, I am a massive fan of the original Robocops. They were pretty fucking gruesome. And I do like the shade. It's kind of like a, kind of like a dystopian steel kind of colour, do you know what I mean? Kind of blue, kind of grey, kind of steel, kind of dystopian in a dystopian crate. Okay, now this next one I know Loz is very fond of. And so am I actually, to be fair. And it looks like I could have got a few different ones, but I got the big... That's not Big Daddy, that's the wrong game, isn't it? Don't you have to help me out here, mate, because I don't play Fallout. Who's that? Is that just the character? It looks like... So, well, it just looks like a model of one of the Power Armor suits. Power Armor suit. That's cool, man. I hope that didn't incite Well, when, you, when, you're about, <laughs> when you're about to call it Big Daddy, I was like, going to throw something, but... <laughs> I'm so sorry. I just... I've never actually played a Fallout. Well, I played a little bit of Fallout oh, 3. I blew up Megaton and then kind of left it. I'm so, so Is it Megaton? Yeah. It is Megaton, yeah. yeah. Did you blow it up or did you let it leave? I did the geek thing where you save it and then do I'll both. I'll do both. Do I both. like it, I like it. Okay, so we've also got a Matrix 300 piece puzzle. I mean, it's a bit different, isn't it? I mean, I must admit when I saw the preview for this loot crate and saw there was some for Matrix, I was very excited. So the fact that it's a jigsaw puzzle is a little bit disappointing, I won't bullshit you, but what can you do? You can't choose what's in the crates. Okay, so next up, this is quite intriguing. It's a Terminator 2 plate thing. What, 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 what is this actually for? I don't know. This is just like, there's not even like a, a screw mount or anything. This is a pretty cool pin. You got the nuclear warhead. Probably from uh, Fallout, I'd imagine. Question mark. It's also got this. Now, I've obviously done a run through of this game, or I think I did about 17 episodes, but didn't actually finish it. But it's the key blank from Bioshock Infinite. Now, I didn't get far enough to understand this, and I think it would be massive spoilers if it was. Have you, you've played it, haven't you? I've not played it. You've not played it? Oh, right. I think it's something to do with like different dimensions and shit. Um, but yeah, spoilers. Um, right, so we have, oh my god, I think this is going to be a really cool one to, uh, to flip inside out. But before we do that, we've got the dystopian thingy, so let's just flick through. Bioshock Infinite Key. For some, the key to change lies within. In Elizabeth's case, it's literally in her hands, and now it's in yours. You can display this iconic item and get it cut to unlock whatever door you choose. Ah, oh, cool. So I can actually use it to open my own door. Buzz. Mega crate. Holy Jesus. Robocop mechanical chair. Hey, uh, hot toys. Uh, the Matrix inspired custom PC case. Oh, it's just a case. Okay. Oh no, wait. Oh, I'm broken this graphics card and motherboard. Oh, good Jesus. vault backpack. Bioshock Skyhook prop replica. Oh. And Terminator, Blu-rays, Mini Mega Crate, and Nuka Cola etched beer mug. That's really cool. And the Complete Matrix trilogy on Blu-ray. That's really cool. These are always really cool, really enjoyable. So let's flip the box inside out. It is literally like that, I think. You literally do it like that, yeah, and then you're supposed to get this guy out and fun. <laughs> there you go, you don't actually fold this one up. It's it's literally an open scene, which is quite cool. Pretty funky. But yeah, that's obviously the scene from Fallout 4, which is pretty funky. I've said that too many times now. But yeah, so this has been the dystopian June... May, right? June. June crate. So yeah, that's great. 
Really enjoyed it, gonna be wearing that t-shirt very soon. Loving the funk thing. Matrix puzzle's a bit strange. Um, really like the key, I didn't realise I could literally have it cut to my door, that's really cool. And this will probably sit somewhere for sure. Okay, so yeah, hope you enjoyed, thank you so much for watching. Let's have a look at some close-ups. Yeah, let's have a look at some close-ups. Mm. Oh, I didn't see you there. <clears throat> Hope you enjoyed that episode of uh, Loot Crate Unboxing. It was quite a good crate, wasn't it? I think you should subscribe. Do you know why I think you should subscribe? Because for the first time ever, I actually look like my cartoon. I actually spent a lot of money on looking this way. So for that alone, you should subscribe. But also for the great content that me and Lozzie ship out every single week. Subscribe. Thanks.